Okay, first thing I'm going to do is make that plus the opposite, plus the opposite. Now I'm going to distribute. And when you distribute your multiply, so it gives me 4x plus 4 times negative 2 is negative 8. Now, I don't need to on this one, but remember, check each side. Can I combine anything on either side? No, let me check each side individually. And keep falling for the same trap there, Tyler. <laughs> now I can add up. What do you want to do? Well, it's got to be the x's. We don't care about the constants. We just care about the x's. The 4. Okay, so the opposite of 4x is minus 4x. Yeah, you don't care about the constants. You only care about the x's. So here, that goes away. You're left with negative 8. Here, 2x plus negative 10. Now, from this point, I'm going to air diagram. Times 2 plus negative 10 plus negative 8. Now remember going backwards, when I minus negative 10, what's that really? Plus 10. plus 10, right? Negative and negative make a positive. So negative 8 plus 10 is? 2 divided by 2 is? 1. <coughs> and if only there was some way to check this. Plug it in, right? Plug it in, plug it in. Right up here. All you have to do is plug in 1 for this x, 1 for this x, simplify both sides. Okay. If we have time, we'll do one here, but I want to keep zipping through. Questions? Okay.